Dwayton, Marseilles, McHenry County, Moline. Those are just a few of the communities in Illinois hard hit where flood water is still waiting to recede. Des Plaines, of course, a community no stranger to flooding. The city council in that northwest suburb is gathering for an emergency meeting that it hopes will lead to help. ABC 7's Diane Pathew is live with the latest on what's happening right now. Diane? Good morning to you. This is one of the areas that we're talking about. We're in Des Plaines, and here is the Des Plaines River. Believe it or not, it is slowly beginning to recede. But take a look. Residents really can't do anything yet because there's all this water all over the place. And you've got homes right behind me. People had to leave their homes because of all the water that's still left here. Residents have evacuated. They tried to take as much of their belongings as they could. We did talk to a couple who just moved into their home, and now everything is destroyed. All the floors, everything needs to be replaced. The bathrooms, the bedrooms, the living room, the dining room. Yeah. The Des Plaines River did crest on Friday at about 11 feet. And as you mentioned, Ben, this morning the city council is holding a meeting at 9 a.m. At that meeting, they plan to discuss the current flood conditions. And then they want to talk about the fact that they're going to declare a state of emergency and tell people what's going on with that. Speaking of state of emergencies, I talked with Governor Quinn yesterday. He said 42 counties in the state of Illinois were declared disaster areas. Reporting live in Des Plaines, Diane Pathew, ABC7 News. Ben, back to you. Diane, thanks very much.